Um, hi everyone, how's it going? Uh, today we look at the Kingdom Ultra Magnus. So I actually have been waiting for this for a while. I, I mean, it's a it's a remote from um, Siege Ultra Magnus, but I think it's very G1 Acre as well, which is quite cool. Um, so this is gonna be a very good fit for the rest of Studio Series 86, which is great. Um, so this is a look. So this is basically, as I said before, this is a remote from the Siege Ultra, Mag Ultra Magnus. Uh, they slightly changed all the mode and the painted to make them what you want look. Um, so look at the front, you got the very, I think all the hand sculptures are very, very nice. You can take a close look, it's great. And articulation wise, just basically whatever you can do. So because of the heavy armor, you can't really, like, it's a bit like heavy to move around, but it's cool. Um, that's good enough. <laughs> and arm wise you can do like that so it comes with a two missile one gun and the front it's the front the side and you can see there's a track <laughs> it's just like exposed but i don't really care the back and yeah so uh let's start transforming so let's take out all the guns so what are we gonna do first? We're gonna take out all the armors. So the shoulder part, basically you just need to, uh, come on, take out this, bring down, I think you need to bring down this first and take this out. Same thing for the other side. Bring down this, take this out. For the arm piece, flip this. Now you can take this one down, like that. Oh. And let's do the same for the other side. Slide on. And for the leg part, it's very easy. Just slide on like that. Like this. And from the, the top horn, what you're gonna do is uh, you're just gonna flip the front piece and like this open. And push this thing up and just do like up. Now we got his generic of his body. So this is actually the inside of the white, it's, it's just a white autumn spray. You can flip this skirting to get the another track look. And to, to bring up the Optus Prime hand, you can bring up this, like this. So now I got this white ultra magnet. So basically, so what happened, why they're doing this is, I think back in the very G1 time, all Transformers toys were on diaclones and I think, uh, if I remember it correctly, um, Optimus Prime they called Convoy, and later on they got this power up Convoy, which is just Optimus Prime wearing armor, which become ultra later on in the Transformers make it ultra magnet. So inside of the G1 toy is actually a white Optimus Prime inside. And last time, the other, the other time officially they make it happen is the Deep Dream Wave comic, I think. So inside you can. When Ultra Magnus take out of his armor, he's just like white almost prime. It's really cool. I really like this idea. I think they, they haven't done this for a while, which is cool. Uh, but anyway, so this is inside the core Ultra Magnus, so, so very nice. Um, the white color is very nice, and also the blue paint his face is so cool, and red eyes, very nice. It's <laughs> and the back one, I mean, yeah. Anyway, so I'm gonna transform his, so we're gonna transform to the track mode. Uh, let me just bring down the camera a little bit. Here we are. Oh. So the track mode. Uh, that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna flip this to side. Bring down here. So we're folding the hand. Close it. Now, just make bring up the armor. We're gonna rotate this, and now you can see the track is in front, and just slide it to the back. And we're just bringing the leg like this. And this side can flip in, and the arm part's gonna fall like this. Very easy, very, very easy transform. I like it. Very logical. Uh, that's why I sort of stopped buying sort of party toys anymore. This is just good. I mean, official toys, good. Well, I need to buy more. And anyway, so that's the track mode, the white track. <laughs> very easy transform, very G1 transform, actually. But, so now we're gonna do the rest of the parts. Uh, what we're gonna do, we're gonna have this two arm part, it's gonna stay here. And the top part, you're gonna do like this, everything gonna flow, gonna do like that. This gonna become the top, 
I believe yes and here so this two ping you're gonna put on this all your arm hand armor or what you call it and this one the leg armor you're gonna open the back pan like this and so you got everything gonna extend out like that so now we just make sure like this is gonna become part of back track as well back track track or whatever uh, here we go everything's open and uh, let me think what I'm doing now yes now you're gonna this thing gonna connect to here so you can see the ping here and this ping here is gonna go here and here so you're just gonna slide this thing very easy like this do this back Slide this in. Here we go. Now I just close it. Very nice. I don't know why they didn't do anything. Uh, okay. Uh, here we go. That's uh, sort of done. Now, this part, I think you need to fling this one down. Uh, think, let me think. How do I do this one? Yes. You go like this. And then you can see this too, you got this hole here, it's gonna slide in this, slide into here. Here we are. And now we're gonna connect this back part because here. So what I'm gonna do is you can see here, this two hole, gonna click into this gray pin. So we're just gonna make sure this is clicking first. Nice. Do the other side. Actually, you can, you can see there's another pin here. Actually, I need to do the this the way around. Sorry, my bad. I should flick this actually. So now you can get. Oh my god, what's going on? Here we go. So now you can see this thing going to this hole. Now it is fully nice. Yes. And now I'm just gonna close everything nicely and smooth and bring this one down first actually. Everything can slide in with all the pings. So I can see here and here. Sliding, sliding. Same thing outside. Come on, gotta make sure everything is on the right and go. And so here we're gonna let's see the the bottom part. Let's gonna click in here and make sure this ping is not missed. Here we go. Let's click in on the top. Now we got in the track mode. Oh, that's track mode. It's quite cool. All the way, it's all rear wheel, by the way. So you can move it around. And you can put a missile like here on the top. And on the other side, the same. And the gun, you can just put on top. Anywhere, any hole you, can, you want, you can just plug in. Yeah, whatever. Here we go. Track mode, very cool. I mean, very good. I mean, good enough they did to do our style ultra magnets. Okay, so let's just bring him back. So it's a reverse everything back. Take everything down, 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 down. Click apart. Oh, I'm being careful with this. Yeah. Here we go. Our track is done. Bring back C to the robot mode. Oh, by the way, in the when you're in the core mode, you can flip this one up, but I don't really do it. You always display this ultra magnets for the armor mode, so anyway. So now I'm gonna uh, flip this one, I rotated it. And bring up the ultra magnets style skirting like this, close this, on this, now core part is ready. Now we can do the shoulder part first. Bring this one up. So just slide this thing nicely. Here we go. Let's do the same. Okay, so it's clicking nicely, locked in close, and we can put the can missile now. Here we are. Here we are. And let's do the rest of parts. Oh, let's open everything. Here we go. And take out 
this, got this. No, you can just refold this back. It took me a while to figure out how to fold this the first time I was playing it. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is make sure like everything was folded like this. So when I rotate, everything got aligned on the top, clicking nicely. And you can pull the song in, just sliding. The same for the other side. So let's look at the top. There we go. And yes, no, done. Everything's folded perfectly. And here we go. And bring this one up. So make sure, oh, sorry. Make sure, oh, make sure the whole one's outside so you can plug anything you want on this arm. Same, same. And top one, I'm just gonna fold this thing like this. So fold everything back like that, like this. And bring the king it back. Oh, and bring it down, and here we go. And hold this drawing down. Yeah, it's back. I think it's very cool. It's a very cool toy. I think I like it. I mean, it's a remote. I mean, I get it. Um, sometimes I, I do expect that. I saw at some point. I saw. I really hope they actually use the um. What's it called? What's the guy's name? Yes, Earthrise Optimus Prime to make a new armor out of it to make a new Ultra Magnus, but they didn't do it. They didn't do it. I mean, which is okay. I think that's good enough for me. And as for comparison, we go. So Earthrise Prime, eighty six hot rod. Which is quite good, I think. And uh, yeah, I think size wise is quite good. And so at this point, I think we got all most of the 86 movie character. Let's just bring everyone to show up. So, King Grimlock, which is my favorite so far. And we got Cup. Nice figure as well, by the way. I didn't do it because I saw. I got it quite late. Um, cut. Ooh. Let's bring back camera a little bit. Yeah, I think that's good enough. And we got Springer from Siege, I believe. Uh, I, I, I feel like they didn't do 86 version without to remove all the battle damage. A bit of shame, but it's good enough. Springer. Blah. Blah. Or oh, how you call it? I don't know how to pronounce his name. I just I just read all his name by memory. And I see. Also, I kind of got her. Yeah, so I got most of the eighty-six character from the Autobot side, which is quite good. I mean, I think it's good. They're quite a really, I think they do a good match with that, which with each other. Uh, very nice. Great, great job, Hashbo. Um, and also, just for some old oh, cup, you're old, are you? But anyway, and stand up again. So, for the comparison at the end, so bring you up to the front. We got Siege Ultra Magnus. So, you can see this is gonna get a sort of more Cybertron sort of detail, everything better damaged. And so you can see this is the same mode. This is the same mode, even the outside armor. They just remove all some of the details. And this is a new mode. And it makes the more G1 look. Same for the shoulder part. It's quite cool. Um, the gun is even... I think this gun is slightly bigger for some reason. But anyway, good toy. Put it back. And at the end, oh, we got... Oh, it's quite big, sorry. This is the Masterpiece Ultra Magnus. I bring back the camera, so that's how big it is to compare to Masterpiece Ultra Magnus. So, just also to say, guys, so no, this is the not a white, white Masterpiece of Prime inside. This is like one single unit toy. So, make it. I think they try to do it with armor, but they give up at some point. I believe they probably can do this, do another one for the three version of three of Prime. But I mean, that's comparison. You can see the. 
Uh, Kingdom one's actually quite close, very good looking. I think this is good. I think this is also good as well. I mean, this is a masterpiece, obviously. But anyway, um, cool. Thanks for watching. Uh, I guess see you guys next time. Uh, if you want me to do any toy, just let me know. Leave the comments below. I'll see if I can get it. If I have, I'll do. If I don't, I'll see if I try to get it. But anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.